नमस्कार इंडिया मेटोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वेलकम यू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो हाईलाइट ऑफ टूडेज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग आर दैट ए फ्रेश वेस्टर्न डिस्टर्बेंस इज लाइकली टू अफेक्ट नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया फ्रॉम टुमारो इट सेल्फ विच कैन करेंटली बी सीन रफली अलॉन्ग फिफ्टी एट डिग्री ऑफ लॉन्गिट्यूड एंड एज अ ट्रफ एंड विद एन एम्बेडेड साइक्लोनिक सर्कुलेशन ओवर ईरान एंड नेबरहुड एंड दिस इज लाइकली टू कॉज फेयरली वाइड स्प्रेड टू वाइड स्प्रेड रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ओवर द हिमालयन रीजन वेस्टर्न हिमालयन रीजन एंड आइसोलेटेड रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी ओवर द प्लेन्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया ड्यूरिंग एटीन to uh, 21st of april and also uh, we are likely to receive isolated heavy rainfall over northeast india during next 5 days and as far as heat wave conditions are concerned so over east india uh, severe heat wave to severe heat wave conditions uh, may uh, uh, continue to be observed during next 5 days and the heat wave conditions may uh, uh, take place over the peninsular india especially over coastal andhra pradesh telangana and rayal seema region so now if we look into uh, the observations uh, during past 24 hours ending at 8:30 hours ist of today so uh, isolated hail storm activity has been observed over himachal pradesh and vidarbha during past 24 hours ending at 8:30 hours ist of today and also severe heat wave conditions have been observed over saurashtra over uh, north konkan and uh, and also isolated heat wave conditions have been observed over gangetic west bengal odisha and uh, coastal andhra pradesh so heat wave conditions are uh, defined as the uh, departure of maximum temperatures goes beyond 4.5 degree centigrade from the long period average of the maximum temperatures so here we can see easily that uh, the maximum temperatures have their departure um, uh, uh, close to 5 degree over gangetic west bengal and over odisha and over north coastal andhra pradesh and over isolated pockets of telangana and they are above 5 degree of centigrade over saurashtra coast so uh, these conditions uh, as we can see here the warning map for next 5 days for heat wave conditions that over Uh, bihar gangetic west bengal odisha uh, the heat wave conditions are likely to continue for roughly for next 5 days as we can see here and uh, with uh, in this uh, we can also see that uh, uh, for odisha we are uh, seeing further uh, in, in intensification in the heat wave conditions by tomorrow and day after tomorrow as well on 18th and 19th we are uh, here uh, expecting orange color kind of uh, warning map and uh, uh, like that only uh, Uh, here we, over saurashtra uh, we are uh, again we are uh, uh, expecting again today the uh, repetition of the heat wave condition which was observed yesterday and after that uh, no heat wave conditions because we can see that uh, there is the western disturbance very uh, which is likely to impact uh, by tomorrow uh, northwest india and this will definitely uh, drop down the temperatures over saurashtra region and uh, over maharashtra also next uh, two days we are expecting isolated heat wave conditions and then uh, over uh, telangana rayal seema and coastal andhra pradesh the heat wave conditions are likely to continue during next 3 uh, days with also probability of isolated heat wave conditions over tamil nadu on 18th of april Uh, and uh, uh, during the meantime hot and humid weather conditions would continue over uh, these entire heat wave uh, warning regions as well as over the regions of uh, kerala tamil nadu uh, coastal karnataka south interior karnataka as well as uh, rayal seema telangana and coastal andhra pradesh the hot and humid uh, uh, weather conditions are uh, slightly different from the heat wave conditions as uh, the heat, in the heat heat wave conditions are the uh, kind of uh, 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 intensive Uh, situation uh, of the hot and humid uh, weather conditions uh, the hot and humid weather conditions are uh, roughly defined as the maximum temperatures uh, going above 40 degree centigrade and the uh, humidity uh, going above uh, 50% so and then we come over to the rainfall warning for uh, next 5 days so isolated heavy rainfall activity with widespread uh, uh, fairly widespread to widespread uh, uh, light to moderate rainfall is likely over northeast india during next 5 days and isolated heavy rainfall and snowfall is likely over uh, arunachal today and tomorrow again over assam and meghalaya and uh, uh, nagaland manipur mizoram and tripura and uh, th- thereafter over this uh, entire northeast india isolated heavy rainfall activity with fairly widespread to widespread uh, light moderate rainfall activity is uh, likely and also himalayan region uh, the uh, western himalayan region uh, jammu and kashmir is likely to receive isolated heavy rainfall and snowfall on 19th of april under the influence of the western disturbance which uh, uh, we can see 
over here which is here uh, uh, as a cyclonic circulation over Iran uh, as a cyclonic circulation over Iran with the embedded uh, uh, trough in mid and upper tropospheric levels and we can see the clouds associated with this western disturbance moving uh, eastwards towards the uh, northeast India. So uh, this uh, uh, likelihood is there of isolated heavy rainfall and snowfall on 19th over, over uh, uh, Jammu and Kashmir and then hailstorm activity is also likely over uh, Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand uh, over Himachal Pradesh on 18th and over Uttarakhand on, on 19th and uh, thunderstorm activity is uh, likely to begin from 18th itself and uh, light moderate thunderstorm activity is uh, likely to uh, be observed over the entire region of uh, North Rajasthan, Punjab, Haryana, uh, Delhi and West UP during 18th to 19th of April. So that's all for today. Tomorrow we will again meet with Delhi weather briefing for weather warning during next five days. Thank you and goodbye.